Against Hamas, reminding many of the tragedy of the Holocaust. It's why there was a show of support at the Holocaust Memorial in Miami Beach. Local 10's Annalise Garcia joins us live with that part of our team coverage. Annalise. Eric, hundreds of people gathered here yesterday outside of the Holocaust Museum in Miami Beach. The location was no coincidence considering its meaning. It was an opportunity for these people to come together and stand in solidarity after the sadness they've been experiencing in the last few days. They were uh, they stood with local leaders who came to speak to them in solidarity with Israel. Through song and prayer, hundreds of people in heartache over the terror attacks stood shoulder to shoulder on Miami Beach in solidarity with Israel. It hits close to home. My daughter is in Israel. She moved to Israel in December. She's now in the army. The unity etched on posters and with promising words from leaders on every level of government. It was the single deadliest day for Jews since the end of the Holocaust. And now the world must decide whose side they're on and how they will respond. Never again must be now. We proudly support Israel, period. Police on high alert as a precaution took position atop buildings and on the ground filtered within the large crowd, a sign of comfort for some people still coming to terms with the pain of the past few days. This is much more of another another element of Holocaust. This is, this is an attempted genocide and for Jews, this is not only our land, but these are our people. And so it feels very personal. And this rally playing out at the base of the Holocaust Memorial, a stark reminder of the dark days of the past for Jewish people. The monument you see behind me is a powerful reminder of the terrible consequences of unchecked hatred in human history. And police were here on high alert and they will continue to be on high alert as we do expect more of these types of rallies and gatherings in the coming weeks. We are live on Miami Beach. Annalise Garcia, Local 10 News.